Hi guys, today we are going to see a powerful command called write event log. Now this write event log command was used for writing the events manually to the logs so that it will be useful for you to record an event if it was not recorded properly in your server or system or in your remote computer. So let's go to the help. So these are the detailed descriptions which was given for the write event log partial command with the syntax and the synopsis and the descriptions here. And as it says that it was used for writing an event to the event log. By displaying the log name you can just write the event here. So let's go to the online help so that we can get a more detailed description about the partial command write event log. Yeah. There are more and more information given for the write event log also command with the parameters and the description for the parameters also given here. We're gonna have a detailed look about the write event log partial command here. Let's go to the example. If you see here, I'm just going to copy this so that we can execute the partial command easily by modifying it. Yeah, I'm just going to modify this command here. For the log name, new log. For the source can be my test. For the event ID is described as the thousand. For the entry type is given as information. On the message, I don't mean everything you can just leave it as it is without any issues. I'm just going to hit enter here. Let's see whether it writes or not because I have not opened this partial command in the administrative mode. So let's hit enter. If you see here, the source was not found. It was showing that the source was not found here, but some are already was not be searched and inaccessible log secure. So let's try it out the default for the log name application. For that also it was showing the same error. So let's go and check it out. I just go to the new log first. There any, so there is no log created here. Let's go to the application. There's no log also created here. Let's run this with the administrative privileges. And still it was showing the, the source name by a plus dot exists on the computer. So what we can do is let's check the source here. So let's try out in the different way. That is the my app source was not available in our local computer system. So let's try the So let's try it as a Windows error reporting source. I'm just going to hit enter here. And it was successfully completed. So let's change the log name here. See here, the source Windows effort is not registered in the new log. It is registered in our application. This was a log that this must be matched. So this new log, which was created by me recently, with the help of the command called 
new log event log and since there is some issues in that it was not applying that so let's check out the application and if you see here the description of the event that is windows error getting the phone if you see here it has been successfully created the my app added a user requested future to display so this is how you will just create a manual logs for the event viewer with the help of the command called write event log so it will be helpful for you to manually record all the details of your error report so i think this video might be helpful to you and you can now know how to create the new log manually for the system creator logs so I think this video might be helpful for you and um, thank you for watching my video. If you have any questions, you can just post your comments from the below the video and uh, as soon as I will reply it. And thank you for watching the video.